the first step is to click AP. Click Add Voucher. Enter the vendor's invoice, vendor name, and vendor requested amount, invoice total. Scroll down and click Search the PO you're paying. Click Add to pay the specific PO receipt on the vendor's invoice. Scroll up and click Add Break if any other splits apply on the invoice. Add all details and click Submit. Now, the AP clerk will leverage the workflow tool to assign this voucher to management for approval. Click the drop-down to select the employee. Select John Smith, Management Employee. Click Needs Review to assign this voucher to John Smith. Now, imagine you're John Smith. Find the vouchers assigned to the Needs Review state by navigating to the Voucher List, AP, then Voucher List. Select the state, Needs Review. Click Submit. Find the voucher to approve and click the voucher ID, 10. John Smith can use the same workflow tool to assign it back to Susan Smith, employee who entered the voucher, and approve it at the same time. Click Approve. Now that it's approved, Susan Smith has the ability to create a new payment ID. Include one, or many, vouchers to pay on a single AP payment. Include and apply any debit memos as well. Select your payment method. Select wire. Click mark as paid to close the AP payment and pay your vouchers. That's it. You're done.